Hi, welcome to another Orange Shark Diecast unboxing presented by JCAR Diecast. Today we have the 2024 short card 5785 E case. This was presented as a double taped damaged box, but as you can see, you can really only see the double taping here. The the damage is actually pretty minimal with the, the side corner. So if you order these from JCAR Diecast, this is what you can expect to get uh, on your front porch. Let's see, let's pop it open and see what we got. All right. So, I have not opened a D case yet, so this is all brand new to me. Seems like I'm doing about every other case for 2024, and that's okay with me, because it gives you... With the E-case, you have a little bit of a D, little bit of D case and a little bit of E case. So let's pop these open and see what we get. All right. So we have first off, we have the 73 Jeep J10. Let's get a good get that nice and up close here. So this is a our um a new model for 2023, but this is the next version of it in 2024. So this was actually in the uh, D case. So this is a D case carryover. We have the K&N Deco on it. New cell uh, bubble on here. Look at that. It's kind of slanted. I wonder if that helps get it in, get it, the fit it in the case better. Not sure. All right. Very cool observation there, though. Next, we have the 1991 Mazda MX-5 Miata in black. So that this is a new to the E case. But there's some back deco on there. All right. And then we have the Land Rover Series 3. All right. Next three cars out of the case. We have the Piranha Tear from the Hot Wheels Megabyte Series. And then we have the, oh, we have the Godzilla Nissan Skyline GTR BCNR 33, the HWJ imports. So this is the second uh, Skyline to feature the Godzilla Deco on it. Very cool. If you remember the one from last year, it was the R32. Next we have the 67 Chevy C10 pickup from the HW Art Cars. Probably shouldn't cover that up there. There we go. Nice, uh, kind of a, what was it? Like a little, um, a little driver in there with the steering wheel, a little old time racer. Very cool art. All right, next three cars out of the case. 73 Honda Civic Custom. Compact Kings. We have the 2020 Ram 1500 Rebel, all black. That's pretty cool. And then we have the Flippin' Fast. So this is a new model for 2024. And this is actually one of the new models for the E-Case. So you'll first see this start to appear in the E-Case. It is a double-sided Hot Wheel. Look at that. So you can flip it either way, upside down and around. Man, what were the... Uh, there was the the cars from the early two thousand early nineteen uh, nineties actually. They had the uh, they were the flippers or something like that where you could flip them over both ways. So this kind of lends itself to that idea. Cool to see that idea return. That was actually I remember having those as kids and they were actually pretty fun to play with. All right, GT Scorcher from the the Hot Wheels Let's Race. So this is going to be a new show on Netflix. Can't wait to start to watch that. I believe it's a cartoon, so it should be good for the kids. All black. Good deck on that one. Then we have the, oh, the return of the Alfa Romeo uh, GTV 6 3.0. This time it's all gray. So we had white and red last year. This time we have an all gray version. Very nice. Different wheels, too. Look at the arrow wheels in this one. 
Oh, and the return of the Glory Chaser, this time in orange. So we have the Glory Chaser now. So this was actually part of the D case. So we, you know, with, with each mix, you get some you get, uh, half holdovers from the last case and then half new cars from the current case. We have the Roadster from the D case as well, International Women's Day. We have the Valentine's Day, no, sorry, Leap Year, Roger Dodger. Look at that. So if you remember the uh, the Chevelle, there was a Chevelle back, uh, man, I think it was 2009? Or was it a little later, maybe 2012? Had this similar, similar deco. You have to look it up there. Very cool. Kind of cool to see a deco return. All right, we have the Corvette Stingray in red, part of the HW Dream Garage series. All right, oh, another new model. This is my first time seeing it, but this is actually one of the DK's holdovers. The Vespa 90 SS Super Sprint 1966. Originally, when I first saw this, I thought this was actually uh, the Deadpool scooter. Kind of looks... Looked similar because I think it was a Vespa, if I'm not mistaken, but this is clearly a different casting. So the brand new casting for 2024. Next two, next two cars out of the case. We have the 92 Honda Civic EG. This will surely be a uh, popular, popular one. And then the uh, brick and delivery. Look at that. The mega blocks. Got the flames on the side. Nice bright orange. All right, next three cars of the case. We have the Surf Duty, Beach Patrol Deco. So it's another car from that Let's Race. I'm interested to see this, this Let's Race and see how many of these cars are actually appearing in the show. All right, we have our second Vespa. Oh, all right, and this is the, the Cadillac Project GTP Hypercar. It should be turbo. So this is the car that I've been most excited to see. A brand new casting for 2024. And it debuts in this case. Look at that. Like a satin or a matte black. Oh man, this is cool. Can't wait to get the set and photograph it. Next three cars out of the case. The Mazda RX-7. Police Deco. The Ice Charger from Fast and Furious. HW Screen Time. I wonder if this, oh, this is the bullet hole version. Look, there's the, there is the, can we pick that up? Yeah. A little hard to pick up on camera here, but there are, there are the bullet holes. And then, ooh, a new for 2024, we have the Pontiac Aztec Custom. So they slammed a Pontiac Aztec, the voted the most ugly car ever made. And they, you know, there's some Easter eggs in here. If you're a fan of the show Breaking Bad, there is a couple of nods to Walter White or Heisenberg with his black hat and his glasses back there. And I think the color has a little something to do with it as well. That's really cool. Another new model. Great. So this is a great case for new models. Between the um, well, the flipping fast is okay, but yeah, this the the Aztec Custom and the uh, the Cadillac Hypercar is pretty cool. All right, we got the Boom Car, the Street Wiener, another Hot Wheels Let's Race. All right, you got the 87 Audi Quattro. So this was one of the new models. This is my first time seeing it, but this is one of the new models from the D case. Next three models out of the case are the HW4 Track in red, the Volvo XC Recharge, and Another new model, the Silverado EV RST. So look at that, an EV Silverado. 
This is a nice proportion truck. It actually is really nice and big. And it's got some surfboards in the back. Look at that. Surfboards. Two surfboards. We'll see if the surfboard trend continue. Next three cars out of the case. The Alfa Romeo GTV 3.0. Again. The Lane Lowrider. Look at that in black and green. That looks cool. Some flames. And, oh yes, the Pagani Zonda R. New casting I've been collecting. In dark red with like some lace, the new lace wheels. Interested to add that one to the, uh, the Pagani collection. All right, the Aston Martin's 1963 DB5. We've seen this one before. James Bond 007. And then we have the uh, 89 Mercedes-Benz 560 SEC AMG. This was the Super in the last case, in the D case. This is the standard variant, of course. And then we have another one of those 92 Honda Civic EGs. So that's the first half of the case. Let's pop open the little partition here and take a look at the second half. Get the top three out. All right, first three cars out of the case. Ho oh, ho, all right, we got the Baja truck from Hot Wheels Let's Race. This one's in a race team deco. Fans of OrangeStrikeDieCast.com know that I am definitely a fan of a good race team car, and this one is one of them. Woo, that's nice. Add that to the collection. The T Rex Destroyer, Megabyte. In red there. And then we have the 23 Ram 1500. So this was one of the the new cars from the, the D case. The new the new models. Look at look at a rake on this thing. It's got a reverse rake on it. That is nice. Another new truck. Man, some of these trucks are really cool. And they're all gonna fall. The only problem with the short cards is they all fall out. Well, that was pretty good. All right. Got the custom 72 Chevy Love. Kind of an olive green there. Another GT Scorcher. Oh, another Godzilla. All right, we got another Godzilla here. The uh, BCNR 33 Nissan Skyline GTR. Three cars out of the case. All right, we got so we got the '67 Camaro here, but this is not. This is kind of the um, the '67 Camaro that is the newer casting. So this isn't the the old school casting from 1983. This is the new casting. It's got a front end that's clear, part of the window piece. So this is the art cars one. The, another Land Rover Series 3, Series 2, excuse me. A uh, Oh, okay, we got a golf car here. We got the Shelby Daytona Coupe from the HW Race Day. Always nice to have a golf car. Next three cars. All right, so we got another Jeep J10, 73 Jeep J10. Great casting. Love that casting from last year. The 67 Chevy C10, another one of those. Ooh, and the 1970 Dodge Charger RT. It should be art cars. This is a casting I collect. Great to have another edition of it, even though it, it's a little little um, colorful, but uh, you know, sometimes, you know, color is a spice of life here, so not too bad. It's fun. All right, next three cars out of the case. We have the another ice charger. We're not out of room here. The Piranha Tear. Seen that already. Another of the 71 Honda Civic Customs. All right, so we have the Street Wiener. 
seen that. All right, the 57 Chevy, I don't think we've seen this one. The It Should Be Art Cars. Look at this, it's 57 Bel Air in there. Get a close up on that. Yeah, it looks okay, the classic casting. Reminds me of the van that, that was done in the same style a couple years back. All right, so this one, we have a new to, uh, new to the main line, is the Diora Alpha 5. So this is the new concept by Diora. We have the RLC Mattel Creations 2-pack, where this was featured in there. So now we have it new to the main line in the E-case. That's really nice. Oh, the, a recolor of the Monster High Ghoul Mobile. The Ghoul Mobile. I just like saying that one. A pink windshield, pink interior, black body. Really cool. Another one of the Glory Chasers in orange. And the 89 Mercedes Benz 560 SEC AMG. It's that one again. Still on the lookout of for the what is, we're looking for the super and the basic treasure hunt. The basic treasure hunt is the forever Batman Forever Batmobile, and the super is the uh, the Fiat. So still on the lookout for those. We have the HW4 track race day. We've seen that one already in here. The Mazda RX-7 Police Deco and the Chevy Silverado EV, both of which we've seen in the case already. All right, we've got the grass chomper. So the, the minifig grass chomper, it should be right ons The 10 Camaro SS, the Hot Wheels response team. Nice looking in that, that kind of bird green. And oh, another Cadillac Project GTP hypercar. Great to see another one of these in the case. Oh, all right, so we have the 60s Fiat. This is not the Super. We're running out of room here, so the Super does not appear likely, but let's keep going. This is still a great standard release. Kind of a cream color, right? A cream metal flake on there. I don't know if we've seen that color before. All right, we got another one of the Flippin' Fast and the Roger Dodger. All right, we got the Mustang Funny Car. This is a pretty cool deco. This is art cars, right? Yep, art cars. There's a dragon, oh, that's cool. All right, another 87 Audi Quattro. And the Tank Nader is back. Another Ride-On's car. For your Mega Blocks minifigs. And the last three cars out of the case we did score a regular treasure hunt. Look at that. Batman Forever Batmobile. Can we get in there? See the uh, little symbol there? Where is it on the car? On the car, it is. It is a lot harder to find on the car. Is there a tempo on the car? It's gotta be a ghosted tempo, I believe. I don't know. I don't see one. Well, the the little treasure hunt symbol is there, so it is definitely the the regular treasure hunt. Great to have this one though. I remember the uh, the Val Kilmer Batman growing up from what nineteen ninety seven. I want to say Batman Forever. So cool to see that Batmobile back, and as a treasure hunt. And then we have the Pontiac Aztec, Aztec Custom, another one of those. So it looks like we got two of each new model in this case. The Flippin' Fast, the Silverado, the Aztec Custom, and the Cadillac uh, Hypercar. And then the last car out of the case is another casting that I actually collect. So I'm excited to have this one. It's the 15 Jaguar F-Type Project 7. So this is from the HW Roadster series. So this is new to the uh, E-Case. 
Look at that. All white. So we have the old lace wheels on here. The wire spoke, lace wheels, whatever you want to call them. Great version of that casting, though. We've seen this one in dark green a lot and red. I don't think we've ever... We have seen it in white, but we haven't seen it with this deco. So usually it's got the little blank roundel on it. So a new version of that casting. Well, that concludes the uh, 2024 A-Case short cards from J-Card Diecast. Make sure you check out jcarddiecast.com for all the latest Hot Wheels cases and Hot Wheels releases. I uh, hope you enjoyed the unboxing, and we'll see you for the next one.